Takayasu's arteritis is a rare type of vasculitis, a group of conditions that cause blood vessel inflammation. It is in the category of large vessel vasculitis, meaning that it involves the aorta, that's the largest artery in the body, and its main branches. The inflammation causes the arteries to narrow or thicken. It can weaken blood vessel walls and potentially cause aneurysms and eventually lead to stroke or heart failure. Takayasu arteritis can be serious, particularly if not recognized or treated promptly. Mayo Clinic's Dr. Kenneth Warrington says early detection is key, but with a long list of symptoms similar to many other health issues, getting to that diagnosis isn't straightforward. Autoimmune diseases can be difficult to diagnose, but certainly need to be considered so that again treatment can be started before there is progressive damage from the conditions. Takayasu's arteritis, like many other forms of vasculitis, is typically treated with drugs like prednisone. But there is still the possibility of progression of the disease and of flare-ups during the chronic phase of the disease. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Jason Howland.